Hello, my name is Philip Berber and I'm speaking to you from Austin in Texas and I'd like to speak to you today about Brent Werbeck and uh, the possibilities for him in uh, the Google organization. Um, I've known Brent since he was 16 years old and the first time I met him was uh, at a tennis court and um, part of the fiber of the man is the intensity and the focus and the competitiveness that I saw Brent bring to his tennis game, which uh, he succeeded in being an extremely highly ranked national ranked player, and that got him a scholarship at Boise State University. He played for four years representing the university at the NCAA level, and uh, that was just uh, one example of the commitment and intensity and focus and driven competitiveness that uh, Brent brings, in fact, not just to his tennis, but it, it's the fiber of the man, it's the making of the person. Um, I also want to speak a little bit about his leadership and, and innovative qualities, and that's particularly in the area of what's called um, Esmeralda's Run. Um, Esmeralda, um, his mother, died from cancer a number of years back, and um, in a very creative and innovative way, uh, Brent created an annual charity run, a run, a sponsored run, that would raise money in honor of and in the name of his mother, and that those funds would go to uh, um, local Austin charities. I believe that the most recent one, which is in his third year, raised thousands of dollars. Um, I want to speak about my memory of him standing up on a physical box standing up on the first run, announcing to people the importance of the run and drawing people to it on, on that first day, all the way through over the last few years how he's using social media, radio and other and internet and other means to get the word out to a much larger audience and he's, he's created Esmeralda's Run here in Austin as one of the Runtex events that uh, it is, is, has, gr has great and growing uh, success. Um, and third aspect that I want to just mention briefly is I've watched his early stage um, career um, uh, with round two with his previous employer um, there he was willing and able to go out and work in the in the in the shed in the in the warehouse and get his hands dirty because that's where he needed to be for the first number of months and go on on site and and and, and collect in essence other people's uh, recyclables and bring it back to the to the warehouse and work on that and then got opportunities to come in on the sales and marketing side and specifically on the sales side. Um, and I would say that that experience of working in a small startup um, in sales, both face to face and on the phone, has really sharpened his saw in terms of his ability to, to act in a very effective way, both in lead generation and also in terms of sales and salesmanship. Remember Esmeralda's run, another job of salesmanship how he could bring hundreds of people on board around the idea of going for a run in his mother, in the honor of his mother's name and raising money for local Austin charities. Um, he is a very smart, very capable, uh, quite intense young man and I've hired literally hundreds of people over the years in various entrepreneurial ventures. He is exactly the sort of guy, Brent Werbeck is unquestionably the sort of guy that I would I would hire and, and bring on board and, and include in, in any team. He's a leader. I remember the Texas Cup, that was a team tennis event. It was when he was probably about 17, 18 years old. There was about 30 uh, young players, of, of me, guys and girls of all age groups, playing for the Austin Tennis Academy and St. Stephen's Tennis Academy against other academies around Austin. And he would be the guy, the team leader, the guy in the, the middle of the huddle. He'd be the guy pulling out the, the final game in the third set. I remember there's a photograph of him um, with his headband on and his, um, his um, tennis racket in, in hand, um, clinching the match, clinching the set uh, for himself and most importantly for the team. So team tennis has been an integral part of, of his career, tennis career to date, and I have no doubt that the skills, the intensity, and, and overcoming adversity um, that he's learned through the, through the game of tennis uh, apply to how he conducts himself in business. I would highly recommend, without hesitation, 
Brent Warbeck to you, and I know he'll do himself and you proud. Thank you very much.